What's going on everybody? Welcome back to JD Details. Today's vehicle is a 2018 Ford Explorer and this vehicle is in need of some serious help. But before we jump in, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button, like the video. So let's get started. All right guys, here I'm starting out with the pre-wash stage. So I'm just going around with the pressure washer, trying to blast away any of that initial dirt before moving on to the wash phase. For the wheels, I spray down some of my wheel cleaner. Then I use a couple different brushes to agitate and loosen up the dirt before pressure washing it off. With this vehicle being as large as it was, I actually had to get out my little step stool. That way I was able to get to the roof without missing anything. Cleaning these WeatherTech floor mats, which in my opinion are some of the best floor mats you can get. I'm spraying down some Meguiar's D101. Then I'm gonna use my drill brush to agitate, loosen up any dirt or anything that's stuck onto them, and then you just simply rinse them off.
Now that the exterior is complete, I can turn my focus to the interior. Here I'm going around with a soft hair detail brush and my vacuum. This will help me pick up that initial layer of dust and any dirt or crumbs. I really have to give it to Ford for the quality of carpet they put in this Explorer. It made it so much easier and way less of a headache than some of the other carpets that I've done. Now these seats weren't actually bad. The customer actually told me not even to worry about them. However, I went ahead and did a light shampooing and extraction because I just couldn't hand the car back over knowing that the seats weren't done.
using some Meguiar's D101 diluted 10 to 1 in my detail brush. I'm going around all the hard interior surfaces, giving them a good clean and wipe down. Using my favorite product 303 aerospace to protect all the interior surfaces I highly recommend you picking up a bottle of this it does numbers and bringing back that nice matte black finish to the vehicle you can find the link to this as well as anything else I use in this video in the description
All right, y'all, that does it for today's video. I wanna thank you for following along with this absolute beast of a detail. If you haven't done so already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. That way you don't miss out on next week's video. So y'all have a good day.